Hello and welcome back to my city skylines. Let's play series before I say anything else I just want to say a huge thank you to all of you for all the feedback on the last Video I got a lot of feedback with the road system and also with the Industry section over here why we don't have any workers. So thank you all very much for the feedback also on the reddit page where I posted the video asking if I had done this in a good way so thank you all for all the feedback. I will put a link to the Reddit page down below in the description so you guys can check it out if you wish to look at that and look at the people replying there as well. And of course a huge shout out and thank you to all the people commenting and giving feedback on the road system in the last episode. Also, a big thanks to Spearcaller and Dark Prince for suggesting a name suggestion. And out of the two, I have chosen spirits or spirit callers um, name suggestion, which is Bean City. <laughs> and the other one I think was uh, Dark Prince suggested Vichy Land E, <laughs> and it is quite funny. But I do think that Bean City sounds more short and rolls easier off the tongue. Off the tongue. And uh, the other one, eh, it's a little bit of a tricky one. Vigi, Vigi Land E. It's a good one. I like it. But uh, I think we will go for the Bean City. If I can find the rename button. Uh, here we go. San Rico? Nope. Not anymore. Bean City. There we go. Boop. Bean City. Alright. So, speaking of the feedback. I know now why we are missing workers in the industry section. They're basically missing workers. They, there's no people to work there, really. Um, all right, so I am cutting into the recording here just because I'm not sure if what I said is 100% correct. We do have a population of like 4,600 people and then the industry is still missing workers. I don't know how this works. I guess all the educated workers and people are just working in the commercial area maybe instead of the industrial area, I'm not sure. But if you do want to know a little bit more about the details and such and look at some of the feedback for yourself, you can look at the comments at, on the last video. I will link it below in the description as well as look at the Reddit page I posted. Um, link down below in the description as well. I got a lot of feedback both on the video and on Reddit. So thank you to all of you guys who did that. Um, but yeah, just as, a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as an example, um, Risto Salonen commented on my last video saying industry isn't getting workers because you're having an actual shortage of workforce in your city. Hence the residential demand being very high. I guess that kind of makes sense. Um, if the place wants work and people wants to work there, they of course want to move there and they can't move there. So they want the demand. And Jason also gave a very good explanation, I think, as well. I won't, well, read it out loud, but you can uh, look at the screen right here. It should be on the screen right about now. But yeah, I'll just give you a couple of seconds of no speech so you can pause and read that if you want. And again, check out the feedback from the last video and also on the Reddit page. But yeah, that's just why I was cutting in there. Sorry for the interruption. Let's continue. As you can see, we have a high demand for residential zone. What we want is to have that near zero. Um, based off of the information I got from the, all the feedback from the last episode, we want this, uh, for residential, the demand for residential zone to be lower or near zero. And that should, um, fix the issue and then have industry and commercial a little bit higher. So that is what we will be doing today. We will be expanding our town with homes and such. We are also nearing the population of 5,000, so hopefully we'll get that going as well. Now, the road system. So, there is two main things that I want to do. First off, I want to move this roundabout. This little T-section here, very bad. It's gonna become a bottleneck in this um, city. So I think actually what I will do is probably remove this road um, completely, and then I will Probably move this down, I think, and then well, maybe we don't even need to do that. Yeah, like, yeah, move it down and then connect this road directly to the roundabout. Um, I don't, or actually, I might just move the roundabout into this road here. Yeah, I think that might actually be better. So, you know what? Let us actually begin and do that right now. Um, 
yeah, so let's get rid of that. And let's start a making a roundabout right here. So if I go to the cost of actually, so we will have to get rid of this one as well, unfortunately. Bada beam, bada boom. And then right in the middle here. Is that metal? I don't know. It's fine. So cost of 100. And like so. And in the middle of the two, cost of 100. Let's just buy measurement tool to see how far it is on each side. And then uh, let's see, we got two lane roads there. Yep, so yeah, that's all we'll need. And then take this one right here, put it right there, put it right there, and right there, and move out a bit, and right there. Perfect. Get rid of the stuff in the middle, don't want that. And we should be able to just connect these up right here, like so. Uh, like so and then these should be able to just go on like that so if I just pick this one and we pick it right on top of the arrow and I do something like this and then here on top of the arrow do something uh, that's not even let's see it down like here so how on earth did I manage to do that? Let me just put it somewhere. Let me tr just try and get this right somewhat. Alright, this is probably as straight as I can get it for right now. Now all I want to do is check for junctions. We don't want any traffic lights or anything like that. We just want them to go straight through like so. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. I think I will say these guys to stop and hold if anyone is coming and let's see how that goes let's just see how that goes and we'll take it from there hopefully I have understood all the feedback correctly now one thing I did also get as feedback and also realized myself was that these guys or the ones coming this way on the highway for like import to the industry section do not have an actual place to go to the industrial section if they come here then they have to go off onto this roundabout and then back on the highway so we need to fix that it is very annoying that it is raining and also sunset so it is very dark on the map but I'm sorry um, so I basically need to get this somehow back over to here or something so let me just see alright I think this is the final uh, fix here so let us take a look here so if we just select this right here so all cars coming down here can go up into the industry section and they can of course go into town um if they come through here they can go in here they can also go into the industry from this lane of course as i just said um but if they come from this lane they can go over here and then if they want to go out they can either go out here or they can drive up here and then down here if they need to go back into town Hopefully that makes sense. And then of course this roundabout here. Let me just make sure that there's no traffic lights or anything like that over here. No. Alright, and I do think that I want to say for... Make way for the... Um, for the people coming here. And... Yeah, I think that is good. Yep, I think that is good. Um, those two should just be able to make it through because I did make this one a two, two lane, uh, one way two lane. So, yep, I think that should fix that issue, hopefully. Um, then also we shouldn't get as much traffic here because cars shouldn't come from the highway and then have to turn around. From what I can see, if you see any errors or something like that for what I've done, please let me know down in the comments below. Alright, so he took the off here and then they are making way for each other that is good 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 yes that is beautiful 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 all right i really hope this rain will go away soon because it is quite annoying to have but we will continue anyway um we just need more residential area to be honest with you um if i could actually see what i was 
doing and planning. But let us start off with some water. How's the water stuff going? It's going good. How about the electricity? Uh, off the charts. Okay, wonderful. Okay, uh, let's just start off with putting water down because I mean we'll need that no matter what. Should be good. All right, then that area is covered with water stuff. That is good. Uh, does everything down here have water? Yes, it does. Okay, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. We just need to get more people in. So let's start building some roads. Um, <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Let us start with making one huge road down here, to be honest with you. How about we make it to here? Actually, we make it a little bit further. And then we move it down here. Here to like yeah right here at the water that should be fine hopefully and then maybe another big road right here down this way could we get one over here oh we can we can let's do that then and let us add another big one down here I suppose and then we will just branch off of those, I think. Make it look a little bit interesting, not that uh, boring stuff. We'll try not making it boring. Let's see, can we get a huge park here? Let's see. Small park, small playground, park with trees is nice. I think we'll get one of those right here, like so. Uh, I think we'll slow down time here just a bit. Um, it needs power. Okay, it'll get power. Power, 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 power. It'll get that eventually. Uh, let's move this down. Ooh, we can actually add paths and stuff to this thing. Anyways, let's just concentrate on the roads for now. We can get back to those. So, if we put something like this. Ah, let's... <laughs> yes, let's just start adding roads down here. So, if we add it like here. And if we just expand it down that way down this way a bit and we just hmm what is this here two lane gravel road so support supports low traffic I do believe there is there should be somewhere small paths aha I found some paths in the um, landscaping tool just because we can add some paths going to and from the roads. We want that, obviously. Yeah, that'll work. Something like that. I like the look of that. I like the look of that. Okay. I'm kidding. I'm, I'm getting completely off track here. We need residential area. <laughs> uh, let's okay. Let's move on. If you have any suggestions for how I could maybe, um, for how I could develop the the town with like shapes and such, let me know down in the comments as well. Because I'm not a good designer, so any of that sort of stuff will be appreciated. Let's add that, add that, and you know what, we can even add that. Oh dear, that's not good. It needs its power. Add it up, there we go. Okay, so we also need, of course, some commercial areas and such, but I think we'll be good. Okay, so, of course, first of all, I want the zoning to be Expand it down this way. So just going along here. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Include all of this. Yep. Now we can start zoning stuff. So I think we leave this out. Maybe actually, let's just expand the road down like so. Um, I don't like that many traffic lights near each other, but it's fine. We'll get rid of that eventually as well. Um, but yeah, I'll, I think just putting houses down. Maybe add some um, commercial right here in the middle, maybe. 
maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. And then houses in here, I think, would be nice. Maybe not on the main road here. Maybe not on the main road. Let's remove that. Um, we could have commercial here as well, to be completely honest with you. Yeah, you know what? Let's, um... <laughs> I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but let's just make that commercial as well. Um, and let time grow. Let time grow? No, let time go. Uh, yeah. Let's look at that. Okay, let's take a look at the city policies real quick. Recycle plastic. Uh, recycling centers work with 20% efficiency costs. It's recycling center a week. Let's just add that. Because why not? Recreational use. Slightly increased tax income. Moderate... Moderately increased tourism, slightly reduced crime rate. Yeah, let's just do that. That's good. Parks, mega city parks and plazas in the country. Um, moderately increased land value around parks and plazas. Increased the parks and plazas budget by 20. Let's take that as well. Uh, slightly increased health, slightly decreased happiness. How happy is our people? They look pretty happy. Smoking ban is bad. Smoking forbidden. Smoking is bad for your health, people. Slightly reduced garbage accumulation, slightly reduced tax income. Recycling, we want to recycle, of course. Pet ban, we don't want to ban pets. No, no, no. Uh, significant risk of fire, upkeep. Yep, that's fine. Water usage, moderately reduced water consumption. Ooh, we reached Bitsy Town. Uh, we unlocked city planning policies. Level 4, unique buildings, leisure and tourism, unique buildings, oil industry specialization. Then we have new policies, free public transport, heavy traffic ban, combustion engine ban. So this, only electric cars are allowed in the affected area, except for the residents, have business and city service vehicles. Please note that this policy takes some time to have an effect. Citizens with combustion engine vehicles will avoid the policy area, but if there are a destination within the area, they will travel to it. Everyone living in the policy area must switch to an electric car if they own any cars. Nice. Filter industrial waste. Zoned industrial buildings need to filter their waste, making them pollute the ground a lot less. That's good. Except we won't need that one because we will get, um... We will... Because, uh, okay. I'll get back to that. Highway with sound barrier. That's very good. I want that. So we're basically upgrading everything. Uh, new buildings, we got the hospital, geothermal power plant, community pool, oil power plant, fire station, police headquarters, tropical garden. Tropical garden, nice, 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 okay. Uh, city planning, ooh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, now it's night time again, man. Um, okay, sweet, 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 sweet. We're growing this city, wow. Okay, hold on. Let me just make sure. Okay, so let me get rid of this, this, so we don't have any abandoned buildings. Uh, this one's fine, right? No. Uh, ah, that one. Sometimes it can be hard to hit the right one. There we go. Okay. Um, Bean City is growing. That's good. Okay, so. Uh, what I was saying was the industry, I think we will, yes, we will definitely get rid of this area because it is polluting, as you can see right here. It is polluting. This is that because it is forest industry and it doesn't pollute. So I think we will actually get rid of this entire thing and convert into, um, into forestry. So, let me see in zoning. Yeah, it's not in any zone either. So let's just... Mm. Get rid of this entire thing. I think just getting rid of the roads should get rid of the buildings. Get rid of this. Uh, we will need to move that. We'll move that over there. We'll move that over there. Tell you what, we'll move it over there. Uh, I don't know what that is. Uh, that's just a building. You, no road access. You do now. There we go. It's like the sensor has been moved. All of these should now disappear, because, yep, nowhere to go, nowhere to be, except for this road here. We want to remove that. Uh, I'll be able to see easier once, um... Yeah, that doesn't need to go anywhere either. Uh, all of these needs to go, go, leave, leave, leave. Uh, 
what is this? Firehouse, of course we need that. That's why. Achievement unlocked at Greenest City. Yay, that's good. Uh, let's add that to here. And let's remove this. We don't need this here either. We want the greenest city possible. The greenest city possible. Um, I'm sure all of these will get filled out eventually. Let's just take a look here. Um, elementary school availability. Ooh, do 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 do. Uh, uneducated. Uh, me, me, me. Elementary school availability. High school. University, of course, is low. We don't have any university, do we? Public library, community school. Well, we need another community school. Where can we plop this down? Well, we can plop it down right here. Right next to the other one. Do we really need that? Hold on. Let's take a look here. We have a school here. Um, students, almost full. And where do we have the other one? Right here. Uh, pretty full too. It's going down into the red. I don't think I will buy it until we get into the red because we do still have space. Um, high school. Where do we have the high schools? We only have one high school, huh? Uh, that's also getting close to the red area, but again, I will not upgrade that until needed. Uh, let me see. University, that is at 7,500. So we're not there yet. How's health? Uh, health is looking good. Uh, let me see. Pollution, we're doing good. We're doing actually pretty good. I'm a little bit worried about this. I did see this though. The polluted water is getting near the pump, so I think we need to move the pump up. Let us actually do that right now to a safe spot. Now these guys will get a little bit of the noise, but I'm sure it's fine. Just, we literally need it like up here. And then just connect it with a pipe. Like so. There we go. It'll be back. And hopefully power is fine too. Yep, there we go. Okay. How is garbage collection? Garbage looking good. Health looking good. Fire. Hazard. Uh, it's fine. This is... Whoa. Why are we needing power? Okay, of course. Not power. Water. Uh, we need a fireplace here. So let us just put it... Um... Hmm. Right here, to be honest, should be good. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Put another one right there. Police looking good. Public transport. We do not have that yet. I think we might look into that in the next episode. Tropical garden. That is looking nice. Nice, nice, nice. We could have that here as well. But I do think we need something else down here too. So maybe right in this corner, maybe? It's a little expensive. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, let's not put that there yet. But I think we're looking good. Uh, electricity especially. Water is getting a little bit eh. Let's take a look at the budget here. Uh, water is there. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. I think we might just need another pump. Yeah. I think we'll just need another pump in the next episode. How's the traffic looking? The traffic is looking good. Um, it, it is red, but everything is moving. There is no backing up or anything like that. So that is good as well. That is really good. I would say we're doing good. Now, what I do want to do. I uh, see. Now I think we have some industry being used here. Um, what I did want to do was to upgrade to this highway sound barrier. Because that reduces the um, that basically reduces the the noise the highway makes. So definitely want to do that just for the place where it's close to the city, because it does generate, as you can see, some. Uh, okay, that's actually not too much. It's not a busy highway. It's not a busy highway. Um, yeah, we also have these much, much, much more pleasant roads here. Which if we upgrade this, for example, let's just upgrade this. Like, look at the trees. Looking so much nicer. Like, so much nicer. It is amazing. We just upgrade all of these. It looks so much nicer. The city looks so much greener and happier. Yeah. 
It does cost money, but hey. It is looking sweet. I think that's pretty good. All right, I am talking and it's probably boring. I am sorry. I will probably do some of this off camera or in the next episode. I just am very excited if you can't already tell. But yes, I will probably do some of that off camera, making the city look even better. But anyways, guys, I think that will do it for this one. In the next episode, we will decide where to put a hospital. I have no idea how far this range is. Also, it is 65,000, so we want to know exactly where to put this thing. I think in the next episode, we will develop the city over in this direction and up and over in this place. And I think I will place a hospital in this general area, as well as with the fire station pretty far. But yeah, we will place a fire station, a hospital, and did we get the police? Um, oh yeah, the police headquarters as well. We'll figure that out in the next episode, so I think we will do that, expand the town, and also look at some public transportation. And then I think some more industry as well, expand this industry over here. So expand industry, expand town, public transport, and police station, uh, hospital, and fire station. The big ones. But anyways, I'm going to stop talking now. This episode is probably already too long. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave it a like, subscribe if you haven't yet, and enable those notifications. And yeah. That's pretty much it. Also, follow me on Twitter and join my Discord server. Links down below. I'm probably going to stick around here and upgrade some roads because this is fun. But yeah, I'm, I'm not going to let you watch all that. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. This city is looking good and I'm happy with it. We might even expand to another area, but I kind of want the city going into this area up here. I um, meant the industry going in this area, so yeah, we'll see. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you next time. Let me know if I talk too much, if I, yeah, talk too much, I'm too boring, or something like that. Let me know down in the comments. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.